So the first question I have for you is, is this an environmentalist mission for you or is this an economic development mission? It is both, it is both. Uh, I firmly believe that if we don't step up to the challenge that we have in, in global climate change, I'm gonna continue to see the 100 year floods that I happen to see almost every year. I'm gonna continue to see the droughts in Eastern Washington. Uh, and the devastation that that's taking. So clearly that's a part of my mission. But the other part of my mission is I believe the 21st century is clean energy jobs and our state is an example. So I want to send that message there but I also want to get companies that are interested to consider coming to Washington State. What is it about Washington State? How are you up there with Governor Schwarzenegger and Governor Doyle and part of this elite group of three that's going to Copenhagen? What is it about our state? You know, I think we stepped out early. We identified climate change for all obvious reasons uh, because of the severe weather that we have experienced in our state early on in my administration and we started to form a coalition with our fellow states that are on the on the coast and said so we've got to work together so we started in 2005 with a clean car initiative and we have moved on since then so I think our leadership is being recognized um, Georgetown is is paying my way uh, I've been Not there the state we got that in there. Yeah, not the state, University. right, exactly. Okay, yeah. So I've been a keynote um, speaker to them on numerous occasions. So I think we are seen as a leader. But the other thing is, you know, when we set a goal of 25,000 green jobs by 2020, and we already have 47,000, I think that tells us exactly where our economic future lies. And so I think there's a recognition. Washington State's providing national leadership. Okay, two more quick questions. Just for the sake of our audience, none of whom will be going with us to Copenhagen, what are you looking forward to? What's gonna be going on? What, what are the things that you're gonna be involved in directly? Well, we have a day where we will, it's called the sub-nationals. What it is is governors and mayors from around the globe that will have a special day dedicated there. So I will be on a, on a panel and pre presenting at Copenhagen with two of my fellow governors and three um, um, folks out of, out of Canada. So it's a great opportunity for us, again, to send the, the word about our national leadership and our preparation to be the home of great clean energy companies that would like to locate to a state that's got a future in this area. But the other thing is I want to learn uh, as well about you know what they've done in Europe on the ground level. If I can hear more about what they've done and take the benefit of their failures and their successes and put it into policy in Washington State. So I'm gonna deliver a message, but I'm gonna be a good listener as well. Partially talking, partially listening. Yes. Excellent, absolutely. so if in one sentence you summed up what your mission is going to Copenhagen, what would that be? Uh, economic development and a great uh, future for the environment in Washington State. Thank you so much. Yeah, it's going to be it. great to see you over there. And, Look forward uh, to it. See you in Denmark. Yes, thank you. Excellent. Thank you. See you Thanks. there.